Who is this uncircumcised Philistine that he should defy the armies of the living God? And the people answered him in this manner, saying, So shall it be done for the man who kills him. Now when the words which David spoke were heard, they reported them to Saul, and he sent for him. Then David said to Saul, Let no man's heart fail because of him. Your servant will go and fight with this first time. And so said to David, You are not able to go against this first time to fight with him, for you are a youth, and he a man of war from his youth. But David said to Saul, Your servant used to keep his father's sheep. And when a lion or bear came and took a lamb out of the flock, I went out after it and struck it and delivered the lamb from its mouth. And when it arose against me, I caught it by its beard and struck and killed it. Your servant has killed both lion and bear. And this uncircumcised Philistine will be like one of them, seeing he has defied the armies of the living God. Moreover, David said, The Lord who delivered me from the paw of the lion and from the paw of the bear, he will deliver me from the hand of the first time. And so said to David, Go, and the Lord be with you. I will be going to the house Omutuwa na agenda na alwane na umufilisu uchoyo. Saulo na agamba Dawudi nti. Toye nza kusinkana na umufilisu uchoyo kuruwana na ye. Kumanga gwoli mulezi mulezi. Na ye ye, musajja mulwanyi okufambu chobwe. Dawudi na agamba Saulo nti. Omutuwa, ya lunda angendika za chitawe. Awabu wajanga, empolo goma, owe dubu. Nejo mwana gwendi gamu chisibo. Nemfuru manga, neji gomerera. Neji kuba. Nenji wanya nganji jamu kama kayo. Awe yanga loko kelanga ko. Nenji kuata kuchilevu chayo. Nenji kuba nenji ta. Omudu wo ya kube mpolo goma elane dubu. Nomu filisu ucho ya chali mkomole. Aliba nge buku zo. Kubanga asomo zeza ejeli ya katondo mlamu. Dawudi na yogeranti. Mukame ya mponya mungjala ze mpolo goma. Ne mungjala ze dubu. Ali mponya ne mkono guamu filisu ucho yo. Saulo na gamba Dawudi nti, genda, elamu kama, anaba na awe. Verse 48. So it was when the first time arose and came and drew near to meet David, that David hurried and ran towards the army to meet the first time. Then David put his hand in his bag and took out a stone, and he slung it and struck the first time in his forehead, so that the stone sank into his forehead, and he fell on his face to the earth. So David prevailed over the first time with a sling and a stone, and he struck the first time and killed him. But there was no sword in the hand of David. Awa Dawudi na ingiza engaloze Musa woye, na jemwe jinja, na rifumula, na kubomfili suti ya chenyi, e jinja na liingira mchenyiche, na agwanga yevu nise. Awa Dawudi na wangula wacho wa mfili suti, na rifumulo, na jinja, na kubomfili suti na muta, na yenga temuli chitala mumukono kwa Dawudi. To God be the glory. Echiti wa chindeli katonda. No winner. Te wali muanguzi. Without a competitor. Ataliko amuvuganya. No success. Tewalibu wanguzi. Without a challenge. Ah, wataliku somozebwa. Could this be your day for success? Luna luandibanga lwe lunakuluo oruobu wanguzi. Could this challenges? Okusomozebwa kuno. 
lead you to success. Kwandibanga kwe kukutwala mubu wanguzi. To God be the glory. Echiti wa chideri katonda. God was looking for a man who could stand and defend his people. Katonda yali anonya omuntu obo musajja yali ayinzo okuyimirira nalwanirira abantu be. It may be that all your clan is poor. Chinzo kubange chikache wa mwebo nabo nabo avu. But you have believed God. Na yenga gwe okiriza katonda. Now God has chosen you. Kakano katonda akulonze. Put you forward. Na kukulembeza. To be the one leading your family. Okuberanga gwe huyo akulembe de family.